got two in I got two out of X. Oh, it's Santa! I got two out of X. Tell Liv! Tell Liv! I got two on the spike. I got one in the crease. I'm hot. Pull it! Pull it! It's a gun! Pull it! Hi, Bill Cranebrink is my name. I'm with the Morgan State Lacrosse Club. We're here tonight at a, a practice, but we're also trying to raise money so that we can go to Cuba. Uh, we have been given an opportunity to um, travel with the choir, and it's a unique opportunity. I have on the team a couple of architects, a couple of engineers, and this is an absolutely dynamite opportunity educationally to get them to some place that people just haven't seen for 60 years. Uh, hello, my name is Skylar Hargreaves. I'm a junior construction management major and I'm a member of the Morgan State Lacrosse Club. Hello, my name is Kevin Ingram. I'm a sophomore at Morgan State University. I'm an architect major and I'm a part of the 2016 Morgan Lacrosse Club. Okay, so we're actually looking for just some funding to help out our lacrosse club. And you know, I mean, it gets a little tight in the car from time to time. But you know, it would be really nice if we could have some funding so we could basically have like a bus and proper transportation for our equipment and things like that. Uh, yeah, so the funding is important. You know, even though we are college students and stuff like that, we have books to pay for. It's also, a, um, we want to make this lacrosse, club across uh, a D1 sport so that we can put them fundings that we, we get for scholarships into also our sports as well. So you donating money will help us, help us get our equipment, help us pay for games, help us travel more, help us compete and you know be able to pay for our refs and be able to have transportation to and fro to each, each game. The league fees for uh, the nickel, which is the league we play in, are um, $1,050 a year. And that covers tournament costs, assuming we are good enough to get into the tournament. We've done that once, but uh, we need to get back there. Um, we pay $130 for uh, officials for, for game, and we have three officials per game. Uh, if we go away, of course, it's a $500 bus ride at the minimum. And if we go to some place like Hampton, it's not only a $2,000 bus ride, but it's also 500 or, or so for uh, hotels and then uh, another couple hundred to, to feed everybody. So the, the money's being spent on the, the kids, and this is almost the ideal situation because we don't have anybody on salary, everybody's a volunteer, all the money gets spent on the the. The, the young men on the road, uh, and they get an education this way. This is just not only good for, for um, them because we push them for good grades as well, but it's also good for the school because we have a history in, at Morgan of, um, of lacrosse and, and we're trying to honor that history. Fixed. All right, because we are a club, we are able to raise our own money, and that money goes to the Morgan State Foundation, which the money is also given to us. Since the club has started, I mean, since I've been a member of the club in the year 2012, I've seen the interest for the club grow, and I've seen more guys come out and just want to be a part and just want to be a part of this family that we're starting here. And some guys don't have equipment, some guys have never played, and it's kind of hard to get them up to speed if they don't have the proper equipment. So funding would pretty much help us get everyone up to speed and make that dream of one day being a Division I HBCU lacrosse team 
come a be, make it come a little bit closer and a little bit faster. Last last uh, year, Hampton declared Division One status, and. Um, we were all disappointed because if anybody has ever gone to YouTube and Googled ESPN Morgan State Lacrosse, they, they know the history of lacrosse at Morgan. And uh, we really wanted to be the first ones back. But Hampton beat us to it, and God bless them, they're, they're an HBCU that's playing in the lacrosse league, and we're, we're all for them but we desperately want to join them. So we're actually trying to have a, a lacrosse camp this year um, for high school seniors. And we're going to try to entice as many men as we can to join the, the uh, school here at Morgan so that we can change the, the male-female ratio and the dynamic and we can get a little closer to getting that div Division I team. So we, we need all the help we can get. And if um, you would be so kind as to send us some money, we would absolutely spend it appropriately and educate these kids well.